Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bankside Cuisine. I've got my rods out and we're going to make a really quick little Spanish style toasty for you. Really simple to make on the bank, minimal ingredients, but let me talk you through it. So first of all, I've got the uh, XL Toasty Pan from Ridge Monkey and here I've got some square little focaccia breads that I've actually just picked up from a local supermarket. There were four in a pack but they're going to fit into here perfectly. So we're just going to put the bases in, take the lids off. As you can see all four of those fit in there without any spare room so that's it you know that's going to really help with the cooking then i've got this little spanish style selection pack so we've got some chorizo in there a bit of salami and some nice iberico cheese all right now as you see i've already put the salami onto there we're just going to put the cheese over now we only get three slices in the pack so we're just going to break this up a little bit Next on is the chorizo. And then just to finish it off for a little bit of flavour, we've got some garlic and some basil to go on there. So we'll just put a couple of basil leaves over the top of each one. And then I'm just going to finish off with a little grind of it. This is a garlic grinder. It's got a little bit of salt in there, some nice garlic, uh, and a little bit of rosemary. Next to go on, we'll just put the lids back onto there. So there you go. So that's our four little toasties made. We've got the onion and cheese for focaccia bread there. Inside we've got a little bit of salami, chorizo. We've got the iberico cheese, some basil and some garlic. Now you could put some sun-dried tomatoes in there, a little bit of salsa, some red onions, anything that you want really, just you know, some olives, anything that you like. This is just a really, really simple, quick toasty for me on the bank and that's how I like mine. Whatever you like, put that into there as well. So we're just gonna close this up now. There we go, and those magnets that hold that shut, and all we want to do is just have this on a low heat. So and what we're gonna do is just keep turning that over, um, so it's gonna cook evenly from both sides. That's gonna crisp up that bread. Now it's a focaccia bread, so there's quite a bit of oil already in focaccia, so that oil's just gonna help that bread go nice and crispy. Then that's gonna heat all the way through, that cheese is gonna soften and melt, and you're gonna be left with a really, really tasty toasty. All right guys, these have been cooking for a few minutes now. We kept turning the pan all the way through just so they're cooking evenly and the bread's gonna color up nicely on both sides. You don't wanna just do it on the one side, otherwise it's, you know, you, you got run the risk of it actually really burning on, on, on the bottom and not cooking on the top. So let's lift the pan up now, and there we go. So you can see those are nice and crisp on the top. The focaccia's gone really, really soft with the amount of oil that's in there. Uh, when they make it, it's a lovely soft bread. And then you've got the chorizo, the cheese has melted through the inside. So all that's left to do now is just plate these up. There we go, guys, they're already plated up. So we've got our lovely little chorizo, salami, and our berico ham on focaccia toasties. We've just added a little bit of basil in there, some garlic powder, and they've come out absolutely stunning. Try these on the bank and enjoy. Enjoy. 